A mutual fund is a financial vehicle that pools assets from shareholders to invest in securities like stocks, bonds, money market instruments, and other assets. Mutual funds are operated by professional money managers who allocate the fund's assets and attempt to produce capital gains or income for the fund's investors. The reason why investors trust these professionals is because of their methodological and pragmatic approach to investing. However, as with any investment, mutual funds are not 100% guaranteed to post returns. How to invest in mutual funds The world is moving faster and faster towards convenience. And these days, everyone avoids the complicated and instead opt for the simple. The days of filing applications and wading through multiple paperwork before adding mutual funds to your investment portfolio are far behind us. Now, you can invest in these funds from the comfort of your home. There are several apps that allow you to invest directly in these funds just with your smartphone. Typical mutual fund returns. In investing, the returns are usually proportional to the risk. For example, Cryptocurrencies promise one of the highest upside potentials, but also have the easiest path to financial ruin. Mutual funds, on the other hand, do not promise over-the-roof returns, but do not have a very steep downside potential. In fact, most mutual fund operators have a maximum drawdown clearly defined in the investment prospectus. Get rich quick versus scam opportunities. How about I double your money for you in one month, but you must bring in three people every month to secure this payout. Sounds familiar? Scam opportunities are very easy to spot and are definitely so different from getting rich quickly. The easiest way to spot scam opportunities is the exorbitant returns and seemingly hands-off approach to making money. How to take advantage of mutual funds. The truth is the rich never got wealthy from investing in mutual funds. They did so by starting a business and growing exponential wealth, and then and only then did they look into options like mutual funds and treasury bills. Starting from scratch, what you need is building your own financial nest egg. Building your financial nest egg is possible through five broad means. An inheritance windfall, a very high-paying career, settlements in the form of gratuity or legal payoffs, unusual financial gains like winning the lottery, and finally exit from a business. If you currently have a low-paying job, look to upgrade your CV and seek higher-paying alternatives. You could turn to other investments for little returns that would offset expenses and bill payments. The key thing to note here is you aren't expecting to get rich from it. If you currently own a business, you should look at scaling. Two stores are better than one and 10 are better than two. Research on new ideas and ways to leverage the internet to reach more customers. In conclusion, mutual funds are considered relatively safe investments, but they do not guarantee over the roof returns. They're great when you use returns from them to offset bills and other minor expenses, but they won't get you rich quickly. To take advantage of mutual funds and capitalize on their compounding effect, you need larger capital. Thank you for watching this video to the end. We hope you find it educative. Please do not forget to subscribe, like, and share this video before you leave. So, what do you think? Are you going to invest in mutual funds or is not your thing? I would like to know what you think in the comment section. So, share your ideas, share your thoughts on what you think about mutual funds in the comment section. If it's something you're willing to try, I will give you options. If it's something that is strange to you, we will explore together. Thank you for watching. Please do not forget to subscribe, like and share this video.